Hey everyone, welcome back. I am Jojo. I am with Shruti. Shruti, we are going to Jaffna today with SKTP. Okay. Yeah, it's the latest oh. drop from um, Maja. A lot of requests yes. have come in for this one, and right. as you all know, we are fans of SKTP. Now after hearing yeah. uh, two of his tracks, hena. Right? So yes, absolutely. This one's called Made in Jaffna. Okay. And I think uh, he's going to be telling us his story. Okay. I think he's okay. so he's he's from a, from what I know he's from a, a Tamil Sri Lankan family and they they apparently had to leave um, Jaffna as refugees uh, back in the day when Achha. things mm-hmm. got uh, really bad so let's mm-hmm. see let's see how this okay. uh, what this track yes. is about shall we ready sure. yes one two three play. Yeah. Woke up a giant trying to find a piece of mind. Mind you, I kept to myself on my island. Quiet. See no evil, hear no evil, even left my left my love to go and serve my light. And ever since the youth was used to moving on my own, a lonely couple, couple gave a fuck about your valid. Ever since the youth was used to moving on my own, a lonely couple, couple gave a fuck about your validation. Came in '86, I was four. We was torn. It was me and Amma, Appa, and my four older brothers. I was youngest and protected. Yeah. In Montreal we landed, landed. but Toronto made a home. Right. Early sunny memories etched on Caledonia Road. A couple factory gigs split between the folks, kept us all afloat. Hearts still full of hope. By '89, suburban dreams was being bought, so we packed it out to Brampton. Expanded out the plot, yeah. I swear I met this kid named Dex upon the block. We best friends to this day, shit. That's the work of God, huh? Cause who'd have known a couple decades down the road? We'd be overseas and rocking shows and getting blown. Uh, but first I had to navigate this adolescence. Twas a lesson in self-hatred. I was placed amongst the racist. Plus the hatred was contagious. Oh, so whitewashed and complacent with them. White teachers, yes. white school, yes. white, white Jesus, yes. white, white rules. Yes. White to Catholic school, white to Catholic fool. Taught the word of God, told to hold my tongue. Never questioned who wrote the books to use when we taught the show. How the West was it, was, it was all dispensed by puppets I was on defense like fuck it <laughs> Luckily for me I found myself an outcast CDN to Andre Benjamin I tend to imagine Luckily for me I found myself an outcast CDN to Andre Benjamin I tend to imagine Okay, now I got my confidence up, I was lifted. I did my history, found hieroglyphic souls of mischief. Through organized confusion, found my voice through all the rockets. I saw my pain in DMX and exit out my conscience. Yeah, yeah. A couple rap groups, a couple rap groups. Later, I was making, making. made a bit of paper. But had to learn through, had to. I had to learn through failure. That I was bound to be a solo dolo star from the start. Hit reset, shit was hard. Hit the bottle, hit my score. Hit the bottom, ripped apart Had a daughter, had no job Debut album was a flop Plus the devil's in my ear talking raw like Oh, you 35 and have it pop Need to stop, use a joke Kill yourself, leave your notebook Next, use a motherfucking bitch Still, I had to shake it off For the sake of me, me ex So I hopped back in the stew And put my foot up on their necks Wrote the greatest shit I've ever penned To send it out my purpose This the tale of King VDP Made in Jaffna, the writer It on my casket to remind them who the god was. Reporting from the ashes, now behold the Phoenix saga. Where to even begin talking about the layers of brilliance in this song, yeah? I was so powerful, man. I'm still shaking. Like, I'm still shaking. Yeah. At one point, I literally had a shiver, like a physical shiver run down me. Mm-hmm. Like, I was just like, I couldn't take it. Like. <laughs> My hand is still shaking. <laughs> and I don't smoke. <laughs> Neither do I. But what a life. And the way he 
showcased it and the way he presented it and spoke about it and just man okay. i don't okay is it we need to di- disconnect the emotion out and first talk about the song i, and, <laughs> I mean i am feeling imposter syndrome right now i don't feel like qualified enough to talk about this song yeah we so, yeah i i i honestly i agree with you like you know cuz forget everything else even just the way the video has been made and edited i am in shock right now my 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 thoughts exactly literally like when i was seeing the way they have superimposed everything the way the edits were going on and what all they have experimented with and put together i was just like listen there's like this is like extreme pro work like what is going on like this is another level this is like whoa this is so much artistry that is just completely um emotionally and just like Uh, in every way it's sort of just blown our minds i think i'm speaking for both of us <laughs> yes 100% yes whether it was the uh, you know whether it was the video the way it was shot the way it was presented whether it was the performance the, the audio the, lyrics, the mixing the, music, the layering the, yeah. the the change in the, in the in the voice texture the the reverbs the you know all the effects added to his vocals the flow changes everything everything and then not abhi to abhi to we have it begun some. talking and then some and the lyrics his, his and his his entire uh, portrayal in the video him as as a as an artist in front of the camera Narrative. oh my god wait this oh. is like i i think this by far on in the indian whatever scene um in the indian hip hop scene i think i have never seen a more powerful video yeah and I, a song I like this is you. just i agree with what you what just happened like <laughs> what just happened <laughs> we're not overreacting right i'm not like this is not like a like you're feeling the same thing right like yeah, it's just i'm completely enveloped wow. in this feeling of like i don't know what i just witnessed but it was freaking art on another did, level did you guys was, go through it as well i mean you're watching it right now you have to leave a comment and tell what you felt about it and like yeah and like without trying to dissect the technicalities of it too much it is uh, yeah. i just want to talk about how we're feeling and that's what we're trying to do right now because that's correct <laughs> you know oh i'm just going to see his comment he's pinned one here uh, okay. pinned pinned by maja he's written it took a lifetime to bring you this album and i feel blessed to finally share it with you i wouldn't be here without your constant support and belief in me this song is a testament to how long my journey has been i hope it can inspire you to keep going i mean you know most of them keep talking about how tough their life has been and i get it because most of most rappers um you know when they put their pain through the song it transcends it 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 reaches us it comes to us and we feel it as well in this yeah. song that pain has become so physical and present mm-hmm. that i think that's what's making us really reel over and not get over it yeah so yeah i i when when he's saying that it's been a lifetime of a journey to bring this yeah it has completely come through you and we've completely come it. through in the lyrics <laughs> in in how he's delivered those lines and just uh, the visual um, impact from the video it's oh my god it's just epic this could be this is this is at par with anything international i've ever seen this is ha- just yes it's not I even can... it's not even about it being desi or international it is just one of the most brilliant videos and tracks i have ever seen telling a story and yeah. just hitting you like you never expected it to and you know just the crossovers the changes were like seamless and not just like lyrically and musically i mean like even in the video it was just and and the progression of how intense it was getting every aspect of the video was matching up to that intensity like perfectly mm-hmm. yeah it was just yeah like i think i'm going to keep coming back to this song with the different things that they have done it's going to just like this is going to become one of those benchmark songs which unfortunately yeah. i am going to compare everything to but i, I like, it's a brilliant you. song and right? you know it's 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 not even like yes this one so far has is my favorite is but every thing that maja has created till now is masterpiece level like there we've been saying this from our first maja reaction they are not cutting corners anywhere this is literally like we're going to find the best artists who are so freaking true to the art and so dedicated to the passion and to the cause of making good art and we're going to give them everything uh, every means possible uh, from our end to to put their story out to put their art out and to and to and, and to give it give it a, give it such a 
strong package packaging correct. or correct. promotion or whatever it is it's just yeah. oh i'm so the showcasing you know they've raised the bar so high and i love them for that because you know it is so important to have a good aspiration to to only if you see some really good work will you actually as a budding you know artist or a rapper or a budding musician you're going to strive to come to that level because yeah, if if yeah. you have something to strive towards that's when somebody's game can actually become better and the scene will improve and yeah. that you know there are so many elements that go into that and this song is like khara utrowing on all those elements which is like yeah. i'm so proud of it right now. i'm like still I'm just, like i'm still getting goosebumps thinking about it and yeah. and um coming to the actual like content of the song and there's so much pain there's so much pain in the yeah in the lines in the story in the delivery and the visuals are really making you feel it i'm just like you know there was there's so much that people have experienced um yeah. during these sort of um um historic milestones like in in history these are like milestone events that yeah. happened and all yeah. of that so we remember reading about them in our textbooks we remember studying about them or hearing about them on the news but you know we really forget to take note of the human experience that that was happening at the time of those events and um oh See, when they say artists, all kinds of art, what it's actually doing is documenting history. This is testimony to that, you know, like it's it's such a true saying, and here we witnessed it, which is wonderful. It's yeah. brilliant. Oh, it's so freaking powerful! Thank you for requesting the song, and Joe, thank you for choosing this one to be played today. Like, so uh, I, I I'm feeling really like yeah. I was tearing up during the song, and I controlled myself, but now like talking about it, I'm just like, <laughs> oh, so freaking Let good! Go. Wow! Wow! Just we're props. with you. We're with you in your journey. It's so, it's SVGB. so, it's so amazing. Um, when you, I mean, when you use art in this way, right, to tell a story that that needs to be told. So, yeah. oh, okay. Check out Miss Bola's <laughs> website. It's linked below. We're gonna sign off because, like, I can't, yes. I can't talk anymore. Can't, can't. And if uh, you liked it, we need to know what you felt about this song. Yeah. Like, hundred percent. Please comment below and let us know. And if you yeah. liked it, then definitely yeah. share, like, subscribe, do that. And share yeah, this song. Share this yeah. song. Make more people watch this video. Uh, yeah. just just share the Maja uh, music because they're they're giving us such crazy good art, and especially this song. I feel everyone needs to watch it and listen to it. So. Yes, share it, and just you know, take care of yourselves. That's all we want to say. Live long and prosper.